getting reports now by email from Oklahoma and Texas of weird lights in the sky and some claims that people are disappearing. Strange things are happening tonight, folks. If you think someone's disappeared, give me a call. I've still got my special line opened up, and I'm going to extend it to anyone in the Southwest experiencing any of this strangeness tonight. Welcome, caller. You're on the air. Hey, Art. Uh, I'm a sheriff's deputy in Carlsbad, New Mexico. That's right near Roswell. Yeah, uh, about a couple hours south of there. What's going on in Carlsbad tonight, officer? Well, I just chased one of those red lights your last caller uh, talked about. It shot right through here. It was up in the sky? No, uh, that's the weird part. I, I, I saw what I thought was a speeder on the, on the highway. So, so I turned on my lights and I pulled out after it. It was on the highway? It, yeah, but like I said, I, I thought it was a speeder. So I hit my lights and went after it. It, it. it slowed down, but then all of a sudden it shot straight up about 50 feet in the air. It shot up in the air, wow. Yeah, I, I got so freaked out I slammed on the brakes. So what happened then? That's the weird part. <laughs> so, so a car, let me get this straight, a car flying into the air wasn't weird enough already? Well, it, it came back down then and started to, uh, well, kind of dance around my squad car for a few minutes. It danced around your car? Yeah, just, just off the ground. It, it'd get close and then back away and then sort of hop over the car. I, I don't know what to make of it. What happened then? Well, it just vanished. Vanished? Yeah, vanished. I didn't see it take off or anything. It just vanished. That's absolutely amazing. You're telling me. And this just happened just now. Just a few minutes ago. There you go, folks. It seems like these lights are moving around the southwest. In other words, Oklahoma, Texas, now New Mexico. I wonder if we're going to see something around my neck of the desert soon. One thing's for sure. This is one weird night. I'm going to take a break, but we'll be back right after the top of the hour with more of your calls.
those fires. Hey, 
It's those guys again. The priestess is waiting. Who's this priestess? It's him. Quiet. Quiet. Shh. Why the hell aren't you talking to me? Let this man pass. He is no friend to our enemies. Greetings. Who are you? You may call me Eluit. We are the Hidden. As with you, we were plucked from our homes and brought here to this place. To this sphere. For centuries the Keeper, our enemy, has used it to harvest beings like us from a thousand different worlds. To be processed, turned into food, warriors, whatever it requires. For generations, the Keeper has been the hunter, and we have been the prey. But no longer. Look, I don't care about any Keeper. I just want to find my girlfriend and get home. Then perhaps there is a way we can help each other. We have been devising a plan to finally escape from this place. The Sphere's technology permits the Keeper's minions to open portals that transport them from place to place in an instant even between worlds. We have stolen some of their machines, and have been developing a similar device, which would open a doorway back to Gaia, Earth, our home. What do you need? Destroy the Keeper. We have the technology to analyze its brain, to acquire the final information needed to open the portal home. Why do you need me to do this? The Keeper has ways of barring us from its domain. But perhaps your... Unique abilities can take you beyond its defenses. The path to the Keeper's bio-experimentation labs lies beyond that portal. What about Jen? If she is still alive, she's being held through there. The Keeper retains some of those it harvests for... experimentation. I've got to get to her before it's too late. If she can be found, she can be saved. Sent home through the Earth portal, with you, with all of us. Do we have a deal? I'll do it. May your gods protect you.